Hi everybody, it's Dee. I'm just coming on quickly now because I wanted to share with you um, the little hitch fastening that I made the other day. Um, when I showed you the um, photo folio albums that I'd made for the Handy Hippo design team, um, I'd put some little handles um, on the edges of the albums to pull them out of the box that I'd made to keep them in. Um, and I have used them before um, and it wasn't until that I'd been sitting forever trying to think of a way to put something on here to pull it out of the box that I remembered that I'd made these um, a couple of years ago. Um, so I thought I'd come along and just show you exactly how I do it. Um, basically it's just just like the Tim Holtz um, hitch fastenings um, which is just um, a paper fastener and an eyelet basically. So I just thought I'd show you what I do in order to put them together. It's super easy. Um, and really good. Um, I've just got these little paper fasteners that I bought ages ago from Morrison's, the supermarket. Um, but I mean, you can pick them up in any stationery shop for pretty cheap. You probably even get them in the pound shop, actually. Um, I've actually got two different sizes in here. I've got some that have got really long legs. Um, and then some that have got smaller legs. But I mean, it really doesn't, doesn't matter in the slightest which you use. Although for the albums that I've used, I did use the longer legs. Only because you've got the the eyelet as well so to have the extra bit of leg length once you've opened them up and put them into place you've got that extra bit of security because the legs are a little bit longer um, so we'll use the longer one today um, and then basically it's just one of your standard eyelets and um, these are just the cheap ones that I got from Wilkinson's I mean you can buy the fancy ones from um, we are memory keepers and all that sort of stuff but just for general use um, the cheap ones that you can get are just perfect. Um, you can buy them by bulk or in bulk rather online for dirt cheap. Um, so basically all you do is you use your eyelet with like the top of it if you like will then be the bottom. So if you hold it upside down in your fingers like that and then just with your paper fastener and just poke that through the hole of your um, eyelet and that's it basically that is as super simple as it could possibly be um, and then all I do just to secure them into place is just pop um, a bit of glossy accents in the like the cup of the paper fastener um, pop the eyelet into into position and then just leave it to stand until the glossy accents is dry um, what I tend to do as well is where the legs of the paper fastener I don't know if you'll be able to see um, where they fold into the cup and um, they can stick out a little bit so what I do just with my tweezers is I just push them down so that they sit properly um, inside that cup so that they sit flat so then when you put your eyelet on it sits a bit flatter inside that cup and then like I say once you've put your glossy accents on um, and it's dry that holds that really securely and then all you need to do is make a hole in your project um, poke the legs of the paper fastener through and basically open them up and then you've got your little hitch fastening which is what I've used on here um, and if you're going to use it I mean you could use it as the closure on a book if you wanted to um, and then you could put um, the hairband the elastic hairband fastening on the other side and then you can loop it up and hook it over um, and it's job done. So there we go, I just thought I'd come on and quickly share that with you. Um, a few of you had commented and said that it was a good idea and that you'd give it a try so I just thought I'd come on now and show you how I do it. Um, it's not my idea. Um, I did find it when I was trawling YouTube years ago looking for various closures for different albums back when I very first started making them um, and came across a lady that was doing this so um, it's not me being really clever, it was somebody else's idea that I've nicked, so I'm just passing it along to all you lovely ladies um, as something else that you can use as well. So there we go. So I need to go away now and get cracking. So thanks for watching and I'll speak to you all soon. Love you lots. Bye.